This is a video on how to download a torrent file using your iOS device. Before we start, there are several applications that you may need. The first one is Documents by Readle. This is a file manager, media player, and also a browser and a downloader. So it's capable of downloading files from a website. Additionally, if you don't have it yet, you might need Dropbox or alternatively, you also can use iCloud. And if you would like to have a third party media player, you might want to download VLC. So in this example, we are going to download a video torrent file from a website called Views. V -U -Z -E. They offer free torrent files for download. In our example, we are going to download a torrent file from views.com slash content. And as an example, we'll download a TED talk called How We Can Turn the Cold of Outer Space into a Renewable Resource. So this is a HD video and this is the torrent file for that video. So we'll download by tapping on download and then this torrent file, which is only 16 kilobytes, we will save it to our iCloud drive by tapping on the share button below and then tapping save to files choosing iCloud Drive. I already prepared a folder named one torrent. Why number one? It's because the folder list is sorted in alphabetical order. So if a number is on front then it will come up on the list. So we select this folder and then tap on add. And then now it's saved to that folder. Now we need to launch documents which is a browser and file manager and also file downloader and this is the main area of documents but we want to use the web browser for downloading the torrent file so here we tap on this blue icon and then we'll go to the cedar.cc website to upload the torrent file by tapping on the plus sign and then uploading the torrent file by tapping on the middle icon with the arrow to the top and tapping on browse and selecting the torrent file we uploaded earlier to our iCloud drive. And then we can reload this page by tapping on reload. And then we'll see that Cedar is collecting information on this torrent file. So depending on which file you are downloading and if it's a recent or old file, there may be many Cedars or very few Cedars. If there are many Cedars, then your file will download much quicker. And to check if it's already done, you can reload the web page again and as long as it says collecting it's still searching for seeds this may take a while but if you want you can do something else or even close your phone and the cedar website will continue on looking for seeds for this file after a while it's now beginning to download the actual video file and this will continue downloading even if you close your phone or you exit the web browser because this is done on the Cedar website itself. So this is done online, not on your actual phone. So you can just forget about it for a while and then maybe after a few hours you can go back and then it will be finished downloading the file and then you can download. 
and there are several caveats to keep in mind when using the cedar.cc free account you only can download one torrent file at a time and you also have a limit of two gigabyte of online storage if you don't want to have those limits and download multiple files at the same time you can register at evoseedbox.com for uh, 150 gigabytes storage at five dollars a month after it's finished downloading the video file to your cedar account you can download it locally to your phone using the documents app and tapping here and tap download then you can choose the folder where to save and then click done and then you can tap on the down arrow icon to see the status of the download locally to your phone once it has finished downloading the video file to your phone you can directly watch it in the documents app because it has a built-in media player or you can open it in another media player such as VLC by tapping on the three dots here and tap share and then look for VLC so to recap First, you search for the torrent file that you want and then you save that torrent file to either Dropbox or an iCloud folder and then you open the cedar.cc website using the documents browser and then you and uploading the torrent file from either your iCloud or your Dropbox and then you wait until it's finished downloading and you can wait also without opening the website you also can just close your phone and do something else and then when it's finished downloading you can open the web browser of the documents app and go back to the cedar.cc website and then download the downloaded video file to your local folder on your phone using the documents app and then you can open it either in the documents app media player or you share it to the vlc player for more helpful tips like this subscribe to one eyed monkey channel or click another video to keep watching now